Earlier in her remarks, Karen mentioned that the Minister of Tourism, Culture and Sport, Minister Chan, would be speaking this evening and participating in the presentation of the awards. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming Minister Chan, the man with the envelopes tonight, to the stage to say a few words. Minister Chan. Well, I think uh, talking to uh, some of the friends here and someone mentioned about, Minister, you've been here three times. I said, yeah, really? That's a long time. So I kind of like, no, I may be here four times. I actually been here four times and Mark mentioned about that, you know, he'd been MC this event for a few years. So I suppose this is our annual meeting. Eh? <laughs> here you go. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, you're probably aware that being the Minister of Response for Culture and in government, I do have a lot of people telling me that, you know, the culture minister, kind of like one year and about two years and it's gone, and I'm probably one of the longest serving culture minister, still alive and surviving. Thank you very much. <laughs> I want to thank a couple of people that uh, really tremendous contribution to, to this sector and of course is the people who leading OMDC and I have the chair over here, Kevin. Kevin say thank you very much for your kind, wonderful work since my time with, uh, with uh, the Minister of Culture. I kind of like able to engage you, know you and I think you really did a wonderful job for, for culture and thank you so very much. And also Karen von Stone is over there. Okay, the little lady here <laughs> over there and uh, also uh, did a fantastic work uh, in this area in terms of the film, the TV, the digital media, the books and publishing and so uh, helping and engaging our ministry. So thank you so very much. And the board members are here too. So uh, why don't we put a, put a hand one more time and give them a round of applause. Finalists, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Premier, Kathleen Min and the Government Ontario, first and foremost, I want to bring you the warmest greeting. The power of the pen has the power to transcend beyond borders and beyond time. It has the power to enlighten and to entertain audiences of every generation and fans of every journey. Here in Ontario, we are truly blessed. We're home to a world of fantastic talent. We're the birthplace of some of the world's greatest artists. And we are a true creative capital, not just in Canada, but around the world. Today, over half of Canada's book publishing industry calls Ontario home. Ontario-based publishing companies generate $1.4 billion for our economy and employ thousands of Ontarians. Clearly, here in Ontario, we are rich with talent, both in our office and our industry leaders. Everyone gathered here this evening is part of that success. Our government, the government of Ontario is proud to partner with our literary sector through our agencies, the Ontario Media Development Corporation and the Ontario Arts Council, because we believe in the creativity of our gifted writers. Because we know that Ontario is rich with innovation from our office to our industry. Because we want to ensure that our story, Ontario story, is a success story. One that inspires the hearts and minds of readers worldwide. Uniting us as a people and as a society. Defining our shared identity here at home and on the world stage. For 26 years, we have been celebrating the great achievements and accomplishments of the, our office and our industry through the Trillium Book Awards. And tonight, we write the next chapter in Ontario's long legacy of gifted writers, acclaimed artists. To all of our nominees tonight, I want to say thank you. Thank you for your passion, your creativity, for your generosity. Thank you.
for taking your great gifts and share them with the world. And congratulations to all our finalists. Maxi.